Okay, we want to paste this table from Word into Excel. The problem we're having is in this right column where the contents has more than one paragraph. So if we paste this into Excel, this will appear in one cell and this will appear in another cell. We want both paragraphs to appear in the same cell. Now this is happening because of this carriage return or paragraph mark. And I'm seeing that because I've turned on the show hide button. So our first step is to get rid of these paragraph marks. And the easiest way to do that is to use find and replace. Now there is a replace button up here, which you can press, or you can use control H on your keyboard. Now you need to make sure that you've pressed the more button, then click in the find what box, go down to special and choose paragraph marks. So we're finding paragraph marks and we want to replace them with a temporary placeholder. So for that, I'm just going to type three hashes. And then we say replace all. Click on OK and then close this dialog box. So now wherever we had a paragraph mark, we have the three hashes. So now we need to select this table. So if you click somewhere in it, Control A on your keyboard will select all, Control C to copy, and then we'll go over to Excel. So we're in Excel and I'm just going to paste that table in. So Control V, I'll just widen this column a little bit. Now you can see the hashes here. We need to now replace those with a line break. So it doesn't matter where you are in your sheet. You need to go to find and select and then replace. Or again, you can use the same shortcut key, Control H. So I am replacing the three hashes with a line break. Now to get a line break, you use this shortcut key, Control J. Now you won't see anything in that replace with box, but don't worry. And then just do Control J again. Now the reason I'm doing two Control J's is because I want to leave a clear line between each paragraph. And then I say replace all, and you can see what it's done here. It's created a clear line between each paragraph within each of these cells. So I need to auto fit the cells. So if I click up in the top left hand corner, double click on one of the lines between the row numbers, and now all the text can clearly be seen. 